Hey everyone, Dennis Kay here with Belize Islands Real Estate. Hope you're doing well today. Today I have an exciting new listing to tell you about. Uh, many of you have been looking for homes or condos, apartments uh, that are already turnkey, ready to move into. Uh, you don't want to go the land route and build. You want to have something already set so you can show up on Amherst Key, turn the key, move right in, keep your boat at your front door and have everything ready to go for you. So today I have such a property. Let me do a share screen and I'm going to show you uh, what one of my clients is offering. It is a three bedroom standalone villa inside the Mar Laguna complex. So it's this villa right here. It's got a nice boat dock out front. And I'm going to go through some of the details uh, with you on this property. But first of all, uh, for those of you who are interested in only the price, the price is 350,000 US dollars. 350 US, uh, that is for a th three bedroom concrete villa on the water with a boat slip in a community that is, it's not a gated community, uh, but it's a community of like-minded uh, owners and villas and condos. And it is extremely close to San Pedro town. The nearest grocery store is literally a couple hundred yards from here. And there are dozens of restaurants, dozens within a short uh, two to five minute walk of this area. So really, really nice. Let me just go through some of these pictures here with you, pull up, pull them up. It is this unit here. So uh, what it is, is uh, let me kind of like show you how the layout of this unit is. So there you go. This might be a good picture to use. So it has uh, two bedrooms on this side, uh, the front bedroom facing the water, and it's got the living and dining area in the center, the living room is facing the water, and then it's got the master bedroom uh, with a attached bath here, this area, plus it has a huge outdoor living space on the top where you can put an outdoor living room and just really make the best use of that space. Uh, plus the owner had a custom wooden deck put out front where you can keep a boat, a uh, 20 to 24 foot Mexican skiff right at the property. Um, and you can be out to the ocean or out to the secret beach side literally within just a few minutes. So let me do a, a, a scroll through on some of these pictures so I can show you some more uh, features about it. Uh, these are the stairs here leading up to the rooftop deck. Here's the stairs leading into the house. You have dedicated golf cart parking. So at least two golf carts can park here anytime. Plus there's, there's more parking available, but at least two in this area. Nice palm trees. The buildings have recently been uh, repainted. So they're, they're looking really, really good right now. Here is an aerial view uh, of the entire complex. So you see how these villas here wrap around here and then this side. So the villa that's for sale is this one right here. So it's inside this nice calm lagoon area. These are condos here, uh, three-story condo uh, buildings. This is the Caribbean Sea, obviously. So I just kind of scroll through, nice wooden deck. Beautiful, those are the views looking toward the south because the villa faces south. Nighttime shots. So there is the floor plan. So as you can see, here's the, the wooden veranda out the front with the lagoon here. So this is where the boat dock is. So it's got the two bedrooms on this side with the shared bath in the center, living room, dining room here, and then the master bath here with a nice walk-in closet. All right, so just a really, really nice layout. Great for Airbnbs. In fact, this one is an Airbnb right now. They're doing very well before COVID hit. And of course, we expect this business to bounce back uh, not only to the same levels they were before COVID, but also to really surpass them. Uh, we're going to see an explosion here of tourism in the next uh, 12 to 24 months. The unit does come completely furnished. So everything you see here with all of the artwork, the furniture, appliances, dishes, utensils, everything is included. What I like about this unit too, it, it has all of the natural hardwood, the Belizean hardwood cabinetry and woodwork throughout, uh, but it is 100% built of concrete. So it is solid. All of the interior, exterior walls uh, are concrete as well as the concrete poured roof. In fact, um, in one of my very first uh, TV shows, Live Here, not Live Here by this, but the uh, House Hunters International, we actually showed one of these villas. And I have to go back and see, this This might have been the exact same villa we showed in the show. I'm not sure. It's, this is going back quite a few years now, probably 10, 12 years ago. Uh, but um, certainly the new owners have really freshened it up and made it look really nice. Also, the bedrooms have AC. There's AC in the living area and uh, just uh, a great area. So this area is, um, 
is the pool, the pool island. So they have a restaurant here at a pool in the center island. Here's pictures of the pool, pictures of the owner's boat. The boat is not included <laughs> in the sale price, uh, but certainly you can pick one up on island if you'd like. Here's just some more lifestyle pics of the owners out fishing, great catch. And like I said, if you have your own boat uh, in front of your villa, you can be out fishing in these waters literally within 10 minutes. It's a very, very short, short boat ride out. Oh, howler monkeys on the mainland. Excellent, that's not too far away. Got some lizards there, Mayan ruins, Lamanai. All that is accessible from Amargus Key for day trips. Uh, <laughs> I love it. So they're doing the, uh, the cave tubing. This is the beaches down at San Pedro town. And since this is an Airbnb site, they include a lot of lifestyle picks and things to do in and around Amargus Key as well. All right. So let me just kind of show you where it is on, uh, on Google Earth. I should have had this pulled up before, but I didn't even think about it. So I want to show you exactly where it is. Um, let's see. Let's zoom out and go back to uh, San Pedro town. So this is San Pedro town right here. So when you land, here's the airstrip. You land, get off the plane. And then if you rent a golf cart to go up to the property, go up to this villa, you just drive through San Pedro town. You go just across the bridge. And then just across the bridge, this is the area here where, where the villas are located. So I'll zoom in a bit and I will turn off the overlay so you guys can see what's going on up in this area. Oh, there we go. So here is the villa right here. This is the one that's for sale right here. Again, 350, everything is included. And you can have a boat. Now, how do you get your boat from here out to the uh, out to the lagoon or, or out to the um, to the ocean or secret beach? It's very easy. So from here, you just take the boat out right through this cut. You're out into the big open San Pedro waterway, and then from there, sneak back around, go up through under the bridge, and you're out right to right to the reef right here. So it's that close. All right, but it's protected in here too as well. So it's a very safe and secure area. And um, just the Lena Point is over here. If we zoom in, I wanted to show you. So one of the largest grocery stores on the north side of the island uh, sits right here. So it's a nice big grocery store. And then, like I said, going north, you have a lot of nice resorts in this area. So you have the cloisters here. You're driving through the Trace Cocos area. So you have a lot of nice single family homes up in this area. You have the Per Boutique um, uh, project going up a little bit further. You have the, the big Grand Caribbean projects. So all of that's up in this area. So really, really nice, but yet extremely uh, close to San Pedro town. All right. So what more do I have to tell you about this? Let me check this, check my notes. So HOA fees, HOA fees are $420 a month. And that includes 24 hour security and also includes your insurance. All right, so uh, insurance completely included on this and it includes your exterior maintenance. Uh, so the painting of the villa, uh, taking care of the grounds, things like that. So 420 might seem high at first, but remember this is a three bedroom villa on the water. Uh, we, 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 could, we could look at this a couple of different ways. We could say, okay, your, your HOA fees are only uh, 275 a month, but then you pay your own insurance. Because that's the way a lot of uh, the counter projects do it. So they, they artificially keep the HOA fees low, but then you as a homeowner have to pay for your additional things like insurance and exterior maintenance and things like that. So the, here it's all included. And uh, this, is a, this is a very, very good uh, Airbnb rental. People coming down are looking for two or three bedroom standalone homes. Uh, if you've been looking for such a thing, you realize there's not a whole lot available on Embergers Key. So it's good as an Airbnb, but also this is going to be a really good long-term uh, retirement home for some of my clients. So if you're looking for an area that's close to all the action, uh, you want to be near grocery stores, near lots of cafes and restaurants, near St. Peter Town, but you still want to have a private, quiet feel, and you want a solid home that's built just like a tank. I mean, this has got concrete pillars down to bedrock, exterior walls, interior walls, everything is concrete, completely furnished. You can have a boat step out front. Uh, th this is a really, really good long-term rental. So you could, you could be snowbirds. You can come down and use this place maybe 
four or six months a year, seven months a year to get out of the US or Canada during the winter time, rent it out the rest of the time to help cover HOA fees. You know, really when we look at it, let me just see um, how many nights you'd have to rent it. So right now, uh, just due to COVID and everything else, the owner had to rent really low, like at 160 a night. But realistically, this sh should turn at least to 225 a night. So if you're getting $200 a night net uh, after expenses, and let's say you're renting just 30% uh, occupancy. So what is that, like 10 nights a year? So 200 or 10, 10 nights a month. So 200 bucks times 10 a month, that's $2,000 a month. All right, so that's times 12. You're looking at $24,000 a year net. And of course you have you know, some expenses, but you'd have expenses anyway. You're gonna to have to pay your expenses anyway on that. So you know, you're gonna have your HOA fees, but that's all part of the, you know, keeping the value of the property. You are responsible for those. But let's say we just have the um, $2,000 a month minus uh, the HOA fees. All right, and let's go just minus some utilities in there as well, uh, that's about a, a profit, a net profit of 1320 a month times 12. So you're looking at a net profit per year of almost $16,000. And this is with uh, just renting it 10 nights a month. All right, so that, that's pretty good. Um, and I think you can actually do a lot more with this as well. So if you're interested in this, or uh, you want to talk to me about it on a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call, hit me up in the link below, I'll be happy to help you out. Uh, oh yeah, is there financing on this? Question has come up. The seller would like a cash deal. Again, 350 cash deal, because he wants to buy something else on Ambergris Key. Uh, so this is what we find often with people selling their properties is they don't wanna sell and, and go. They don't wanna cash out and go. They wanna cash out and do something else, right? Because this seller has particular needs uh, upcoming in his family's future. So they're looking to do something else, uh, but he will consider some financing, right? Depending on what the, what the buyer needs, what they're looking for. And so uh, talk to me more about that. So if you need some financing, um, it's not going to be 10% down. It's going to be more like 20% down. Interest rates at 10%. But he might go for a 10, 20 year AM with something like a five year balloon. So this might work well for some of you guys. All right. So thanks a lot. Let me know again if you have any questions, comments, concerns. And uh, hopefully this is going to work out really good for one of you guys. So looking forward to helping you get your own slice of paradise on Amherst Key. Talk to you soon.